Hi everyone, it's Monday, June 6th. I'm Jim Hummel with your KETC News Brief. We start in Jeff Davis Parish where state police are investigating a deadly hit and run involving a bicyclist. Troopers say Jerry Hughes was struck and killed while riding his bike on LA 1126 west of Farm Supply Road. Tonight, troopers are looking for a small white SUV with damage to the hood and windshield. More than half of the Doosan Police Department is out with COVID. Police Chief Kip Judice and four of his eight officers tested positive last week. The administrative offices will be closed for the remainder of the week while the facility is cleaned. As for policing, the Lafayette and Acadia Parish Sheriff's Office, as well as state police, are pitching in. In Iberia Parish, the process to close the oldest operating salt mine in the U.S. is now underway. Cargill is filling the mine with water, a process that's expected to take 45 days. During that time, no one will be allowed within 800 feet of the mine. Nearby tourist attractions like Tabasco will not be affected. In Lafayette Parish, there's new leadership at the NAACP. Ravis K. Martinez is the new unit president for the local Lafayette branch. Martinez says as an organization, they'll reimagine, reset, and reengage with the community. The NAACP hosts monthly membership meetings that are open to the public the first Thursday of every month at 6 o'clock at Amani Temple 19. Let's get a check of the forecast now with Chief Meteorologist Rob Perillo. Hey, Rob. Hey, Jim. Weather-wise, we're talking hot and humid weather. Typical, but it's actually going to get a little bit hotter, a little bit more humid. Overnight tonight through daybreak Tuesday, mid-70s your low instead of lower 70s. Rain chances staying low again for your Tuesday. Mostly sunny skies. Temperatures topping out a few degrees hotter than Monday. Lower 90s with that heat index right near 100. And as we head into Wednesday, more of the same mid to upper 70s to start and we'll get into the low to possibly the mid 90s for the afternoon. Slight rain chance though on Wednesday in the 20% range. So overnight tonight temperatures gradually get down into the mid 70s. We'll be lucky if we get 75 for a low and then tomorrow uh, 92 the high heat index near 100 and we'll keep rain chances at 10% or less tomorrow. 20% on Wednesday but overall getting hotter and more humid with temperatures in the mid 90s. Heat indices getting up to 105 perhaps 108 and then as we head into the weekend, next best chance of storms comes late Saturday and the heat continues as we go into next week as well with low end rain chances there. That's it for weather and news. Stay with KETC, KETC.com and social media for the very latest.